Hello traders and welcome to our live trading session today. It's through Nalpan from the Master of the Markets Elite Trades Conference and the Traders Open Day. So today's trade in looking at what we have been looking so far in terms of stretch and range and targets. So what we can see today, as we have talked about in previous videos, we saw the stretch line, upper stretch line here, being breached at this bar over here. Here it just closed on it where we have some rules when it does that just to enter on the high of the bar. Okay, if you are entering on a breakout entry. Okay. However, the trades that we are looking right now to enter on is mainly on a retracement entry. So that means if let's say on the upper stretch line it does close above or close on it, what we then look for is for retracement back into the stretch line. So for example, if the next bar went up further, just like in this case, but then after that, we are looking for at least a primary retracement back into the stretch line. And at that point, what we are then looking at is positioning ourselves to enter either on the primary high or the primary minus one high, okay? So just based on that alone, today there has been no trades because firstly, there's not been any primary. This is not a primary, right? And also, even if this is a primary by a little bit, we're taking on this low, which I don't think it is. Let me just check that now on the low over here, 13834, 138444. By one micro pip, yes, it is. But however, this primary has got to at least go back further down into this bar. It doesn't matter where it closes, but at least the low or the wick, as you may call it, must go below the stretch line. Okay, so in this case, it didn't. So this type of entry, what we are looking for, is what we call a retracement entry. A retracement entry. As opposed to here, which is called a breakout entry. Okay. If you enter on a breakout entry because this just closed on the stretch line, you will enter on the high of that bar and then put a target for the range. And the range for yesterday was 78. So let's say 80, 64 pips. If I measured it there, that would have been 64 pips would have been on this bar here. Let me just put that here. And you would have got your profit basically at that particular point. On this bar, would have hit your profit of 64 pips. And if you were to do an MS2 trail all the way on a breakout entry. Okay, so that's the thing for today. Breakout versus retracement entry. This is what I've explained so far. Breakout, that means once it breaks out of the stretch line, we already enter either on the close or on the high of the bar if it's within 5 pips of the stretch line or the retracement we are waiting for a primary as I had drawn earlier back into the stretch line again if it's above the stretch line and into this range over here. Okay, So reflect on this. So based on this, we are only looking at retracement entries for now so we didn't enter on this particular trade today. But of course, what a good practice for you guys to do would be to check the results for both breakout entries and retracement entries. And for those of you who are still a bit unsure about the terminologies we use here, or you want a structured way of learning, we would highly recommend our video courses, which is absolutely for free. So we have the Trader Starter Pack over here, uh, which is... Uh, the five-part video course over here that you can see. And then for the intermediates, we are looking at the Trade Like a Master uh, video series as well. Okay, So you can get this five-part video course absolutely for free when you put your name, detail and phone number. And that will be just sent into your inbox. So this is more for beginner slash 
um, intermediates and then this is more for intermediate slash professionals okay so whichever you may choose to start on these are great materials for you to start on which will build your foundations quite strong and then lead you on to come to our traders base camp package where we can meet you live and really develop you on your trading journey ahead so that's all I think more or less I wanted to tell you in terms of the trade setups for today in terms of breakout versus retracement entries so go and practice for each other day how you would look into a breakout entry and retracement entry what they would have performed what the results would be and come to a conclusive decision okay if you've got any questions at all feel free to uh, reach out to us email us or also look through our video courses as well all right so that's all from me for now and as we always say till the next time Stay disciplined, follow your trading plan, and keep trading like a master.